Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Research and Analysis. My name is Dr. Kamran. Recently, I received so many comments on my videos related to how to find out appropriate journal. Here, uh, I want to clarify, I'm not expert of everything and without understanding your requirement, I'm not able to recommend you any journal. Because in different part of the world, universities prefer different indexing. Some universities, they prefer Scopus indexing, while other, they prefer the journals to be indexed in Web of Sciences. So eventually, it is you who will decide whether a specific journal is fulfilling your requirement or not. In this video, I'm going going to tell you a technique through which you can find out fast track and free journals those who are indexed in Scopus or in Web of Sciences. In this video my focus is on this database Science Direct but obviously you can use the same technique in other databases as well. So once you will open this web address Science Direct so it will take you on this page and on this page you can see uh, here are four main categories uh, physical sciences and engineering, life sciences health sciences and finally social sciences and humanities. In fact it is covering all major disciplines. By default it is uh, clicked on physical sciences and engineering. See it has provided us 1943 publications options related to chemical engineering. So it includes both the journals, books and so on. But we are only specifically interested in journals so we will select journals. If we are only interested in those journals that accept submissions, then we can select this accept submissions. In term of access type, we have two options, open access and contains open access. If we are only interested in open access journals, we can select first option. Otherwise, we can select second option because all journals provide this option to publish in open access. But to publish open access, you need to pay a very high publication fee. I am selecting this second one contains open access. So see now it has provided us 93 journals those who are accepting app submissions and they contain open access. From this list we can open any of these journals to see their further requirements. For example we are opening this journal bioresource technology. And this journal have only three days uh, three days time to first decision and the review time it takes on, on average 21 days. And submission to acceptance, it's on average only 44 days. This is really amazing, by the way. And the time it takes from acceptance to publication is also only just three days. To explore it further, let's just open view all insights. See, from here you can check its aims and scope. You can also click this view full aims and scope. This is the ISS number, uh, subject areas. These are the areas this journal is covering. Uh, this is the impact if you want to see uh, site score it is 20.8 if you are interested to publish in a scopus index journal so it is scopus index and having the site score of 20.8 if you are interested in web of sciences so this journal have uh, impact factor 9.7 in term of publication it provides us two options first is open access but to publish open access we need to pay around five thousand dollars but otherwise we will not need to pay any fee so this is amazing option you can consider as you can see the publication time is also perfect and the impact factor is also really great and the good thing is there is no publication fee for this journal. Now let's explore another discipline uh, health sciences and from this list let's select nursing and health professions because I have received so many requests from this category. From here again journals accept submissions and let's select both open access and contain open access from this list let's just open american journal of medicine see it has the site score as well as the impact factor and uh, wow that's amazing the only 22 days from submission to acceptance i think this is the fastest journal that i have ever seen and the good thing is there is no publication fee so you can consider this journal as well. Now let's explore this journal, Advanced Exercise and Health Science. Actually, there is a reason behind showing this journal because you can see there is no site score or no impact factor. It doesn't mean that it can't be indexed in Scopus or it can't be listed in Web of Sciences. 
but most probably it's a new journal so you need to check its indexing manually i will provide the link of my two videos in which i have explained how you can check whether a specific journal is scopus indexed or indexed in web of sciences uh, you can use the same technique to explore other disciplines as well like on life sciences in life sciences you have many categories and in the same way we can also explore social sciences and humanities and in this discipline you can explore the journals related to arts and humanities business management and accounting decision sciences and so on this is how you can find out fast track journals without a publication fee and those who are indexed in scopus or web of sciences i hope this video will be helpful thanks for watching